Okay. Today we're working on a Philco 4195. Circa 1939. I did an initial look over and clean up of chassis itself. All the tubes test out good. All within tolerance, the um, some wires need to be replaced. Those are pretty bad. Both sides. Looks like it was uh, recapped at some point. Probably by uh, this guy here back in 49. Ten years and then we capped, didn't seem uh, like it lasted that long. The um, underneath, let's see if I can uh, lift this up with one hand here. There you go. Looks like it was recapped. There's a Multi-filter cap there, but it looks like it's only hooked up with one circuit. I only use one of them. A lot of crusty wires in here too, underneath that need to be replaced. A couple down there he missed. sloppy on the solder work but it's all right I like a challenge well it's not much of a challenge it's pretty clean actually got about the parts ordered so I'll work on the wiring first while I'm waiting we'll see how that goes uh, but cabinet, it's right here. Not in too bad a shape. It looks kind of bad, but it's it's actually not. The top here, I stripped already just to kind of test it. It looked like this over here, in here, kind of rough and bad, but it it turned out okay. Nothing's really pulling. I had to reglue the back a little bit. It peeled up a little, but it's fine. So it should. Should come out okay. Here he goes. Real cloth. Seen better days. <laughs> but, uh, got a replacement here. It's not the exact same, but it's pretty close. It looks good. Speaker's all good. It's stashed over there. So that's it for now. Um, I'll go ahead and rewire, and when I get the components in, I'll start installing those caps, and I'll be back. <laughs> 